I say magic. and today I'm at the Belfast Metropolitan College for the exclusive screenwriting masterclass with Ben Schiffer. Ben's masterclass will kickstart this year's Belfast Cinemagic Festival. 2010 is a special year for Cinemagic as it marks its 20th anniversary. Over this incredible period of time, Cinemagic has and continues to use the magic of film and all moving forms of image to entertain, educate, motivate and inspire. Magic hosting a very workshop. How does it feel to be part of Cinematic? Uh, it's great. I, I've done it, um, this is my third time. What would your um, words of advice be to all aspiring screenwriters today? Um, all you have to do is write. How did you enjoy this workshop with Ben? Oh, it's great. I enjoy it. So he's, he's great. Like, he knows his stuff anyway. And he's a good laugh. And everyone seems to be enjoying it, yeah. Fantastic. And are you an aspiring screenwriter yourself? Um, yeah, well I've just started off, me and a friend write a few things. We made a film recently and I'd like to get into that sort of sort of area, definitely. Yeah. So this is really helpful. Now joined by T4 editor Neil McCallum. Hi Neil. So how long have you been involved with Cinemagic? This is my third Cinemagic. So uh, I came last year for a two day workshop and then my first one was probably about five or six years ago. So what aspects of Cinematic do you find appealing then? Um, it's, it's just a brilliant idea, it's a kind of great opportunity to uh, just meet people that are sort of starting out who want to get into kind of television, perhaps aren't sure about exactly what area of television they want to do. Um, and and you know, it's just really good for me to just get out of the office, meet people, uh, hear what people kind of think of T4, hear kind of what people are liking to watch, what they don't like, and just kind of just getting kind of in there and getting people to kind of come up with some kind of good ideas and sort of helping them hopefully sort of facilitate that. We are here um, this morning and this afternoon for the broadcasting workshop with Cinemagic. How are you finding it so far? I'm loving it. This is nice, this is nice, I've just got a couple of children with me. And when I joined, I'm sure neither of these two need any introduction with well, the lovely... <laughs> with I, the, I barely know who he is. <laughs> um, with the lovely Rick Edwards, most known for the T4 presenting, and Mark Thorne, he is the series of research. Um, and it's lovely to see you again. Rick, you were here last year, so... I was, I was, yeah, they, they couldn't keep me away. <laughs> What, you obviously find cinematic very appealing. Yeah, it's really fun. I think it's quite sort of, uh, it's quite valuable as well. I think it, it, I mean, you obviously did it, did it last year. And, and look how far you've come. Um, you, you're here again. Uh, and, uh, and I think that, you know, all the kids, you know, young adults, um, really, really benefit. Um, and uh, so I was keen to, keen to come again, to drag this guy along. Mm -hmm. Oh. He's enjoyed himself, hasn't he? Yeah, it's been nice. good. It's been a lovely time. time. As well as T4, there's Freshly Squeezed, which mm -hmm. I did want to bring up today because I know one of the elements of that was you had a pin-up of yourself, a cardboard pin-light. Uh, yes, I did. Uh, yes. I also heard that you actually don't have any sense of smell. Yes, that is true. That is true. Um, which is handy working with this guy. Um, but, he uh, is awful, Mark, isn't he? Yes, yeah, he's just joking. Yeah, he, he is only just being really, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's been lovely speaking to you. No, very nice to, uh, very nice to see you again. Yeah. Hopefully we'll see you both back next year. And Hopefully. This morning we have been participating in the broadcasting workshop. Can you tell me a little bit about that? It was really insightful and helpful and got loads of knowledge. It was great. I'm now joined by award-winning journalist and TV presenter Mark Mallett. Hi Mark. That sounds very impressive, doesn't it? Well, it's lovely to um, get the opportunity to speak with you today. And you've just finished your masterclass in Cinemagic. How did that go? Oh, excellent. Absolutely excellent. It's, it's great whenever you're working in this industry to be able to come and take part in these masterclasses. I've worked closely with the guys at Cinemagic for a number of years now. And when I was offered the chance of hosting a masterclass, I was like, yes please, yes please. Because it is, it's wonderful to give something back. I mean, the guys that we had in the room here all want the same thing. 
to succeed in the industry, whether it's film, television or radio. They all have that same goal and they all have that same determination. So it's, 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 it's really a privilege for me to come into a room like this and be able to give them even just that small nugget of information, something that will contribute towards that journey that they're on. And hopefully it's been a learning experience for them. It's certainly a learning experience even uh, to this day for me, uh, you know, hearing from the, the students today. You know, I'm constantly learning as well. Uh, so to be able to learn from the other guys that took part in the class and to be able to learn from the students and hopefully then they learn to be better something from us. I thought this is actually our second time meeting because you also took part in Ben Schiffer's screenwriting yes, masterclass. Yeah. It's interesting to speak to you today because how have you found the Channel 4 programme making workshops in comparison to the screenwriting class? Well, like completely different uh, subjects, but um, the team here are, are very good. Uh, ben himself was very focused on so his pattern and everything, those great tips for writing. Um, and here, there's just all the different areas of it. The new down to commissioning was very good, you know, for T4 and uh, 4 Music. And uh, Rick has been great, you know, especially with advice. Thanks very much. So much. Okay, <laughs> cheers, Rick. My name is Philip Nugent. And I'm Cal Hunter. Brilliant, definitely actors, because you told me your name as well. <laughs> is this um, your first experience with Cinemagic? Uh, yeah, for me it is, yeah. I just sort of found out about it a few days ago from traveling around and decided I'd stop in and check it out. What was it that appealed to you to take part in Cinemagic? It was definitely the workshops. Um, I really wanted to do the uh, the acting workshops and the casting workshop as well. I just sort of figured it'd be um, fun, to, fun to do while I was overseas. And, uh, if you could describe Cinemagic in one way, how do you describe it? Is it wrong if I say Cinemagic? <laughs> 